Hey guys, it's here. Welcome to this interview. And I'm here with Ketan Gavan. And Ketan is from Mumbai. He is someone who is uh, he's in the online brand building space and he's developed a methodology on how he's helping people build their own personal brand. Again, came into the Freedom Business Model coaching system last year, started to implement things due to lockdown situation, was able to focus more, get things done. And the beauty is in the last uh, 70 days, he has a community of more than 3,300 people who he's nurturing and mentoring with his skills. So Ketan, congratulations and great to know about your success. Thank you, Sid. And thank you so much for all the contribution you have done in my life. I, I'm indebted to you, Sid. Thank yes. you so much. You're welcome. Welcome. And I'm so happy that, you know, you're also connected with other members in our community like Purushottam. I just saw that interview you did with him and also uh, even Gopal, you know, you've been taking elements from all these different places, but I'm so glad that the journey started with the freedom business model and then you were able to take that and then adapt something unique of your own. So just tell me about uh, just before you got into the freedom business model, what was your situation and what made you get started on this journey? Yeah. Uh, thank you, sir. Uh, see, I'm a self-development trainer. Uh, I mm. started my journey in 2010. Uh, mm. I resigned from my job on 15th August. Incidentally, I'll complete 10 years now. Nice. Uh, mm. When I, you know, when I started, uh, I, I started with most of the government departments. Currently, I train in more than 45 government departments, and Maharashtra mm. Police is one of my major clients. Nice. Uh, mm. I, I train them for almost 150 days in a year. Okay, so it's a very, mm. very uh, rigorous uh, assignment, mm. and uh, it's it's all about you know behavioral skills. My my mm. philosophy is technical skills are only five percent for your success. As mm. you grow in your career, 95% is all about behavioral skills, which is community yeah. leadership planning and all those things. Okay, mm. uh, So I, I started on that journey and uh, believe me, my calendar till 2023 was almost full, almost mm. for 200 days uh, every year. But suddenly when this lockdown happened, you know, I realized that I'll not be able to uh, go back uh, to my training room and impart the same kind of, you know, uh, knowledge, content, passion, it will not be possible for me in coming times. And that's where I realized that, you know, whatever I have started with you from October, October, mm. whatever I have created, okay, uh, I can just, uh, you know, bring it in, uh, in reality and uh, start my online business. And that's what I've done. Mm. Uh, Super. So October you got in and then you said like for a few months, you were not, uh, you're not active. You, you didn't take it. Uh, you know, seriously, then only when lockdown happened, when you started to take action. So tell us about how you're able to, uh, you know, find your niche and your positioning, you know, coming from personal development, doing behavioral training, and then getting into online brand building, how were you able to connect those dots? Uh, it's a very interesting, uh, you know, story behind that. Uh, mm. Um, I, I joined your community on uh, 26th of October and 31st, mm. I think, uh, you know, when you were closing uh, the franchise, I knew nothing, but I said, you know, I want to be with, you know, if I just be with you in your energy, mm. I know a lot of things will happen. So I just, you know, uh, took the franchise and I started attending all the, you know, Monday morning calls. Okay. Incidentally, I was traveling a lot. Incidentally, mm. I was traveling a lot. Uh, so, you know, the, every month I'll travel for 20 to 22 days, pan Maharashtra, generally mm. with police and, you know, income tax, GST, all the uh, mm. departments. So I was learning everything. I was mm. you know, listening to Stranger's Secret every day. Mm. But you know that creative procrastination when you know that you know you have so much already in your hand to take out time and then you know learn systems, start investing. That that block was there. So I was not mm. doing. Uh, incidentally, I met you know few of my uh, my students who have mm. uh, taken your course. Okay. Uh, they are doing, you know, a freedom business model. And when I started asking them certain questions, you know, I realized that. They have not understood a lot of things. Mm. So I started explaining them. They started learning. And then I found out, you know, if I can be just a bridge between mm. all Maharashtrian entrepreneurs who want to establish their digital business, mm. I can just them, you know, sit ready or, you know, freedom mm. business model ready and mm. hand them over to you. Then maybe, you know, their learning curve will be faster. They'll be able to grasp it uh, well. Mm. And even if, you know, in the future, if English is their problem, I can help them in my mother tongue. Uh, so, mm. you know, uh, and since, you know, we are great devotees of uh, Shivaji Maharaj, whenever I used nice. to, uh, you know, uh, say that, you know, what will be my niche? What will be my niche? The first word which used to come to my mind is Swaraj. You know, that is your mm. own fire. Okay. Yes. And that's, that's all, you know, uh, freedom is all about. So mm. I started, you know, getting into it. Into, and then I came out with a word that, you know, online Swaraj blueprint. So online 
create your swaraja with help of our blue team blueprint and then i created my community as mission online swaraja and mm. i term myself as online swaraja sarthi who is helping mm. them to you know get into that so that niche was very very clear that mm. anyone who wants to create brand online and in current situation it has become more imperative yes. unfortunately you have your presence online so i said you know uh, my positioning is without any office employee without help of any social media agency if mm. you can just start working on your expertise and keep mm. going regularly in front of camera and mm. create you know start creating videos in your niche you know you will be able to succeed and you will be happy to know sid i have already mm. conducted six uh, interviews of mm. people who have already launched their uh, online courses after doing our course fantastic fantastic and i'm so glad that you narrowed it down to your uh, your mother tongue your location and you brought this that whole feeling of uh, you know when you say swaraj people able to will be connect with with you you know if they are based out of maharashtra so really nice even in uh, what do you say even here uh, another person in my community his name is i think dharani he did it everything in tamil and he is focusing only on tamil entrepreneurs and now he is i think he's having a huge community now that he's mentoring because of that local connect uh, and bringing in the, that flavor of uh, you know the local connection yeah that's what really matters superb so you, you were able to you know build and create something which is more congruent with you based on what you have said so tell just uh, let us know what were the biggest points uh, that you learned in the freedom business model over the last you know from when you got started were you a technical person did you set up all the systems on your own what were the elements that that you had to go through to build something like this thank you sir mm. uh, the first thing you know which i have learned from you the most important uh, incidentally i was learning uh, i was reading this book by gary vaynerchuk jab 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 and then hook okay mm. uh, so give 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 and then ask for it and when i when i came into your community and the, when i started seeing you know the kind of value which you are just offering for free even if people pay 10 lakh rupees somewhere you know they will not be able to get value which you are offering every week you are coming up with something you are understanding our problem you are absolutely you know even if you know i, I have not done uh, you know this course the knowledge which you have imparted is amazing but then i started realizing you know knowledge is nothing even if you keep swimming in that knowledge uh, uh, for for years you will not be able to implement something because as you always said you know mm. systems work and people fail mm. so you need to create a system and when i when i you know got plugged into your system then i started realizing you know this is what is very very important so mm. i started you know every week uh, sid i go live and mm. i take up some points you know now, now uh, this monday i'll be going for eat that frog for mm. next four uh, weeks you know i'll be just talking about 21 ways of procrastination six or five habits every week that's mm. what i'm planning half an hour every week okay and sit believe me it reaches almost 30000 people in a week my reach is almost mm. 30000 people with that thing so and you know as, as i said as you told us you know ki digital assets that mm. video is there even if i'm not working somebody is looking at it they mm. watch it they register for my webinar they join my community i start nurturing them and suddenly i start getting you know wonderful results so that passive activity and digital assets that is the one thing you know which i have picked up from your side so answering mm. your first question second most important which which you are asking me uh, whether i am a techno savvy person i i'll tell you before joining you i used to hate technology but mm. then i have trained myself you know unless and until you master this you are not going to go ahead okay mm. take click funnel sit on it for 7 days okay mm. take get response sit on it for 7 days if you don't understand you know webinars i have seen your webinars at least 100 times and must have attended for 50 times sit till this mm. time okay when because i always take notes whatever you are saying you know you are an encyclopedia even if people mm-hmm. understand what is there in your mind 10% only you know they will be able to make 3 lakh rupees a month i know that you know that mm-hmm. that is the possibility so that le- with that learner attitude now i I'll, i'll say whatever i am doing today i have picked up almost everything only from you sir thank you so much for sharing that yeah superb just tell me about now the the funnel flow like you know you said you've been building digital assets in fact I always keep talking about digital assets how you can get your content to work for you on one side and then also paid so what percentage of paid traffic free traffic is bringing you these kind of results this 30000 reach and then how do you nurture them and bring them how do you convert them let's understand that flow yeah okay uh, so you know when initially when i started you know 25th april is my dad's birthday and that, mm. on that day i to you know did my uh, first webinar and my since i'm a trainer for so many years you know uh, on that day itself you know my you will not believe my webinar ended in 45 minutes okay and, 
45 minutes. I I announced it for 90 minutes, but I was so fumbling. I just finished it in 45 minutes, and 40 people paid me. My course was mm. not. Okay. Nothing was there. Nothing mm. was there. I launched it on first of May, and in that week I pro- prepared everything, and then I you know I I launched my uh, course. So initially it was all my you know uh, warm contacts which I have developed mm. uh, over mm. so many years. Then I started running uh, you know uh, Facebook ads. I created a one minute video as you taught us you know how scenario is changing, and if you are wor- ready to work on your passion, I'll be able to help you create your own online brand and mm. click onto this webinar and comment. So th- that's how you know I started working onto that, and initially I. Started started getting you know a lot of good response so every webinar i used to get 100 150 200 people uh, mm. come there and the conversion rate was also uh, good but i don't know something happened after that i was not mm. able to you know continue that speed mm. incidentally you know i i stumbled upon gopal as you know yes. we were talking about mm. gopal and i uh, gopal, gopal started talking about you know uh, the the whatsapp class whatsapp I, model Mm. and i have a community of 3500 people so what i do you know i just announce that on this day i'm going to conduct a free course mm. whoever you know first 100 150 people uh, register for it i conduct a four day uh, session again you know i give lot of value the mm. those four days i give lot of value and last half an hour you know i conduct a webinar i told them the knowledge is there but unless and until you be into this system for one year uh, everything what you have learned will go waste okay mm. and people then join and come into so you know i am using the the organic traffic which I'm developing and with facebook ads i am getting people into my funnel nurturing mm. them and mm. you know uh, trying to get conversion from them nice so it's a combination of whatsapp as well as webinar both uh, you you alternate between that yeah awesome in fact gopal is uh, you know he's helped a lot of people in our community and his whatsapp model is is perfect when you're going at anything under 1000 rupees range or even up to you say to 2000 rupees and after that if you want to like sell anything higher than that if any of you are watching this like selling at 5000 10000 and above yeah webinar is a much better way to do it but you need to practice like there's a you know sometimes it's good to get warmed up with whatsapp you know get the confidence you build the stories build the case studies testimonials and then you can start to you know move towards a webinar model so in fact i did a video on youtube and if you can go and just search seven funnels siddharth raj shekar you'll see there are seven different approaches to this game a webinar automated webinar hybrid that i have shared many different models so uh ketan let us know about your whole uh, video creation have you been confident in in front of the camera or was it something that you just you know practiced uh, over the last 3 to 4 months what were your thoughts on that yeah absolutely uh, siddharth and that's where you know uh, another uh, one of our platinum member comes into action and that's uh, purushottam ambade mm. uh when i saw first time you know purushottam's video the first thought which clicked into my mind was you know if he can do it i can definitely do it mm. so you know uh, my first video in Purush- purushottam's community was you know I-, i was i was struggling to decide you know whether i should go for uh, marathi or english but uh, purushottam after listening to you i am very clear what i need to do mm. and then i started creating videos there i created 30 videos there and i'll tell you when the second lockdown was happening i was literally mm. frustrated i don't know what to do now okay mm. and I I took my camera i recorded a th- 30 second video and i said from tomorrow onwards you know i am going to teach you how to make videos and i posted mm. that on to my facebook uh, group and people were said please bring it on fabulous and then i went back and told my wife i don't know anything what to do but mm. she said now you have announced now go and do it so mm. i did some research i started doing it and since i am very happy to tell you today was my 93rd video which i have nice. consistently the the length of the video is almost 7 minutes every day mm. and that has given me tremendous confidence and i'm telling mm. you you are such a god figure to me i would have mm-hmm. never been able to speak so comfortably with you unless and until you know i have practiced those 100 120 videos in last 3 mm. 4 months so it's very very important consistency is the most important pillar for success you know that's what i absolutely uh, really, very very important Yeah many people don't know that I'm also a super introvert never thought I would be able to do videos and connect like this but it's that practice it's that you know you keep doing it again and again I still remember the first video I think I did was 2000 um, I tell you 2000 I think around it was 2011 or something like that you know it was the first and I was so nervous in the camera butterflies in the stomach never actually and then kept doing more and more and yeah i think today if i have to have to look at the numbers i've done i think around 700 plus webinars oh 700 so that's like a and that really uh, you know and even till today i cannot say that i've uh, you know it i've arrived or anything like that like even some webinars there's something new to learn every time so it's it's a constant journey and i'm super proud you know 93 videos that means like 90 days 3 months you've gone at it 7 minutes 
I mean, that would have given you so much. So before that, you've never done any videos. It's like uh, uh, Sid, zero. I'm, a, mm-hmm. I'm a trainer. So, you know, mm-hmm. in, in training room, I'm always there for eight hours. But if you ask me facing camera and understanding all those nitty gritties, you know, looking into the lens, then your mm-hmm. proportion, using the background my uh, music, you know, using the uh, titles. Yes, that yes. itself, you know, there are so many, you know, fine tunings that happen. You know, initially when I started for a seven minute video, I used to take mm-hmm. almost, you know, 45 minutes to edit it and post it. Believe yeah. me, today it is not more than 16th minute. It is already posted. Fantastic. Nice. So everything is set up. Mm. So tell us about that mindset because I know many trainers may be looking at this uh, interview. And uh, yes, there may be a great trainer, good connection on stage, connecting with the audience, all that is good. But what do you see as a trainer, you personally, a difference between the connection that happens in the offline world and online world? Like what kind of, uh, what do you say, uh, uh, Patterns did you have to break in your own mind to be more effective for the online space? Fantastic. Mm. And Sid, in fact, you know, I'll tell you, you have helped me so much into this. I, mm. I can't thank you enough for, for this. You know, I trained a lot of government departments. Uh, yeah. Three days mm. back, uh, I was with uh, 240 IS officers of custom department. Okay. I was taking that session. And when I started, you know, the first thing, the, the head who know, knew me, he said, you know, all of them, the first thing you have to teach them is how to make this interactive. Mm. Very, very important. And I'll tell you, if anybody has to master this, they have to just come and sit in your webinar or one of your class, you know, the way you engage us, the way you, you know, use small, small things to get our responses, the way you shift effortlessly, you know, your screen, that is phenomenal. That is out of the world. Mm. You know, I have, I have attended so many trainers, but there are very few, you know, who can handle this very effectively. So I'll tell you, there are, Every trainer is on, you know, Facebook live, but when I look at their Facebook live, you know, 99% of them don't know how to handle it, how to use, you know, best use of technology, how to engage people, how to, you know, and finally, you know, there is no call to action. Mm. The biggest thing which they are missing is, you know, they are just putting content, 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 but they have no clarity in mind. The customer journey is not clear. Mm. What needs to be done? The product is not there. The funnel is not there. The thought yeah. process is not there. And believe me, uh, six months back, nothing was there with me only. It is only because of you. <laughs> it has came into existence. Mm. And now whatever I start, the first thing is that uh, first question is, what is the call in, uh, call to action? Okay. Yesterday yes. I interviewed uh, Sanjeev Pendarkar, who is the owner mm. of uh, Biko, uh, Biko Laboratories, 500 crore mm. company. And mm. he launched his course for entrepreneurs. But nice. my call to action was very, very clear. You know, after he did, uh, did that, you know, um, there are all, I think in, for, in, uh, in 24 hours, more than 18,000 people have viewed that uh, uh, video already. Nice. I, you know, what is my call to action? There are 200 people who have joined my community after seeing that video. So that's mm. very, very important. Trainers yeah. should know their funnel, their customer journey, and they should learn these skills. Okay. Mm. You are very good in classroom. When you sit in front of webcam and have a setup like this, I can guarantee you this first 30 times you're going to fumble. And unless and until you master these things, you will never be able to have a great impact the way Sid has. I'm telling you mm. very, very important. Thank you for sharing that. And it's, it's a, uh, yeah, it is a different thing altogether. Like looking into the camera, and uh, also understanding the pulse of what is going through their mind as they're sitting in their, on their seat and then bringing all those responses. And, you know, it's like the pattern shifts, you know, to look at, keep shifting the pattern uh, to keep them engaged. Otherwise what ends up happening is, you know, we get distracted. WhatsApp will pop up. Facebook will pop up. They'll look at the screen and that's it. And then they may leave the webinar. They leave the, the training. So it, it, there is a whole science behind it. And most trainers in the offline world, don't realize, or they may be able to do it in the offline, but they, they need to realize how to practice that for the online space. And once it's done, I think this is going to be the future of education itself. I mean, we're looking at where the world is going today. Uh, schools are going online, colleges are going online. And I'm also looking at how my son is learning online uh, school. He has like 40 minutes per cl- a class every day and uh, in two, two sessions. So yeah, the, I can, when I look at the teachers that are teaching, I feel, yes, I think all teachers now need to equip themselves with this engagement skills, yeah. especially kids. I mean, they are the ones who will get distracted the easiest. Yeah. So yeah, this is where, where, where things are going. In, in so, fact, uh, Sid, yeah. my, my son is in eighth standard and he mm. always tells me, please take a session for our teachers. You know, they don't know how to engage us. <laughs> that I, is actually, perfect. it is so important. Yeah, it's so important, especially. Uh, and if you're a teacher watching this, you know, just you know, attend any of our webinars. You'll understand there's a different way and methodology of, of uh, you know, sharing information. It's not about information. It's about the engagement and what you can get them to do after they get the knowledge. So 
uh, back to you, Ketan, like where do you, what is your vision for the next uh, one year to three years? Like where do you see things going with this momentum that you've built till now? Uh, Sid, you know, when uh, I'm, I'm a volunteer in Siddhivinayak Temple, so I, mm. I used to go there for almost 18 years and mm. I meditate regularly. So this vision came into my meditation long back, you know, and I, I keep reiterating every mm. day. Once, you know, you gave that clarity. I always say that, you know, I'm Ketan Gavan, online Swarajya Sarathi, mm. founder of Mission Online Swarajya, and I am on a mission to create one lakh online Swarajyas in next three years in Maharashtra. And nice. you could be the one. Uh, you know, uh, you could be one of them if you take action today. Okay, so that's mm. that's my vision, and that is driving me crazy. That is um, that is you know helping me to get up every morning. That one lakh number is grilled into my uh, mind, and with your support, you know, I know I'll achieve that. You will. You're already at three thousand three hundred now. I, for you to reach that one hundred, no, hundred k will be very very soon for sure. And uh, super. So tell us uh, about your, you know, what was that emotional connect with. Uh, with Shivaji, Shivaji ji, like how, how was that? I mean, what was your, uh, you know, what are the values that you're able to get inspiration from, from a personality like that? Yeah. See in last 400 years, if Maharashtra has produced a world leader, you know, mm. that's Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj. Yes. And undoubtedly. Okay. Uh, he has, you know, supported integrated everybody and he has mm. empowered everybody throughout his life okay? mm. and that word swaraj okay and i always say let it be small but it mm. has to be a swaraj mm. if you work you are never into swaraj yes you are paid for your time not for your skill or you know the quality of work you are doing mm. it, is, it is always eight hours okay and mm. since you know this year it is going to be very difficult for, mm. There will be a lot of solo planners which are coming. If you're able to understand, you know, your top, you know, I, I cover generally unique ability, Ikigai, mm. your top 10 skills. Yeah. And that's where, you know, we say that, you know, this is the area where we want to. And, you know, uh, when I look at uh, Shivaji Maharaj, you know, the mm. kind of contribution, you know, till date, you know, nobody is able to replace him from our mind. Okay. Mm. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm a big devotee of Sri Ganesha, but, mm. you know, if you ask me, Apparently, if I worship somebody, it's always, you know, uh, Shivaji Maharaj. Mm. And it is so easy to connect anybody from Maharashtra. You know, 50% of the people who join group, they said, sir, we don't know anything. The moment we heard this name, Mission Online Swarajya, we said we want to be there. Whatever will happen, we'll see afterwards. But we mm. want to be part of that Swaraja. That, you know, deep connection with our values is there with that, you know, with name, Chhatrapati Shivaji Maharaj and Swarajya. And I'm so happy, you know, that yeah. uh, if I keep working for next three years, I'll be uh, contributing something for his vision. And I'm very happy for that. Absolutely. Absolutely. You know, the reason why, why I asked that question is I could see that you were deeply connected with that mission. And most people in the online space, you know, everything is very external. People want to just pick, you know, uh, which is the hottest tool, which is the push button software, this, that, you know, but no one actually is able to like look at the deeper reason and people be drawn to you by the, the depth of your, your mission. And uh, it's not just about the sales. The sales is, I mean, that's secondary, but what you stand for is very important. I love that quote. You know, if you don't stand for something, you will fall for anything. Everything. There are so many opportunities that are flying around these days in the online. And the fact that you have grounded yourself in this, okay, this is for me, it is like the Swaraj is, is the concept. I mean, people who are able to resonate with, the, with that value, you know, that your vibe is going to attract that tribe and that's what is happening. And that is what is, you know, uh, marketing actually, if you see in the true sense, otherwise everything else is just external. So I'm so happy that, uh, you know, you're, you have taken that up and all of you watching this, you have to find that what is your true purpose, your core. And that is the, that's, what's going to fire up your business. Otherwise everything else, everybody else is doing, you'll just be you know, like anybody else. That unique positioning comes when you're able to find a much bigger purpose and mission. Thank you for sharing that, uh, you know, Ketan. So guys, if you're watching this, uh, you know, you want to get to know more about Ketan, what he does on my YouTube channel description, there's a link to his next session or his WhatsApp class. You can go and check it out. And if you want to actually learn this system that, that Ketan has implemented since October, dive into the freedom business model. There's a link over 7,000 plus people right now and growing uh, in, inside my community who are actually implementing the knowledge and uh, building their own systems and whatever unique position that they have. So jump into the bandwagon, more than happy to help you. Ketan, before we leave, you know, first of all, thank you for your time and thank you for really sharing these valuable insights. 
from all your years of experience in the training industry, working with so many people in the government and all now the last three, four months of all the learnings, if you have to break it down to one success principle that you, if it is on the highest uh, in your life, what is that success principle? Thank you, Sid, for asking that. My only principle, you know, very simple. I always say success is not what you get, but what you become. Mm. Just, just remember this, you know, success is not what you get, but what you become. But because, you know, if you become, then things will be given to you. John, I'll, I'll add to it. You know, John Maxwell always say, he says that yeah. you don't be goal oriented, be growth oriented. Because mm. if you're growing, the goals will come towards you. You don't have nice. to go towards the goal. Unfortunately, people are just focused on getting, but they forget that, you know, unless and until they become, they will never be able to see even opportunities. Because if you're not ready, you will not be able to see opportunities also. So just be growth oriented and all your dreams and goals will be taken care of. That's the only message I have. Sir. Awesome. Awesome. Thank you so much for sharing. And even my mentor, he says, he says uh, you know, it is not about the destination. It is what you become in the process of you going towards a destination. And that is where the magic is. Most people are only looking at the destination. The beautiful one. Yeah. Thank you for sharing that. So guys, uh, if you are watching this on Facebook, on YouTube, please share your comments below. We would like to know what was your biggest learning from this interview that I had with, uh, with Ketan today. And also, you know, subscribe to my YouTube channel. So you know, follow me on Facebook. I keep uh, posting a lot of interviews like this and other information that can really create an impact in your life. So Ketan, once again, thank you. And looking forward to interviewing you next when you hit one crore. Looking forward to that. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.